Hi, I'm Rob. Hi, I'm Sherry. And this is our cat, Lily. This is Cinder. We've got the truck. We've got the trailer. And we're ready for our RV travel class. Hey, RV travel buddies. This is Rob. And this is Sherry. <laughs> and today is our Saturday. And not big plans this weekend. Uh, I think we got to get a camera bag. We're going to do a little bit of experimenting with a. Uh, a new camera and we'll tell you more about it so we needed some time to do that so today we'll try to do some uh, special photography with that uh, see so we flushed tanks today flushed the fresh water tank and just get some of our duties done kind of pick it up a little but you got to do that sometimes you can't play all the time so we're off and we'll tell you more as we go okay we found our next favorite restaurant called Moonshine Barbecue. So uh, here's a couple of pictures. The food was really good. The barbecue, well, the ribs were, what do you think of the ribs, Cher? Sure? <laughs> <laughs> what do they get of ribs? The ribs were really good. I just had a, a Moonshine burger and it was good, but I gotta say the ribs were much better. Um, yeah. We tried did a sample of their chili, which is also excellent. Yeah, that was good. And what else we tried? Oh, uh, the moonshine. <laughs> we did a moonshine. Yeah, so we only had four samplers, so we're good. But uh, we didn't like the, the lemon drop. No, but we one. like the caramel, we like the peach, and we like the apple. Yes. But lemon, lemon drop, drop. not didn't do a thing for me. So saw the pictures you get a chance to get up in Linwood Washington may I don't know if they're a franchise or not but try moonshine barbecue hashtag moonshine barbecue anyway on with the show hi guys we're uh, stopping here real quick so a lot of people ask about what do you do about your mail when you're full-timing yeah. or traveling and so we're not telling you where our location is but we're stopping at our mailbox and what this is is this a UPS store no, it's a Mailbox Plus. The Mailbox Plus, they call it. Anyway, so what's really cool about these places is you can have your mail come to a box. It doesn't have a P.O. box number. It's a regular number, and that's important to have. <laughs> and then uh, when you're traveling, you can call them. They'll grab all your mail and all your packages, and they'll ship them to wherever you're at <laughs> at the particular oh, time. So that's what's really nice about these services. Do you remember what we pay, paid for this? It was pretty reasonable. I'm thinking um, $36 every three months, something like that. So anyway, I'll let you uh, follow us uh, out there and we'll see what, see what it looks like. Saturday this place is not open but the boxes are so we can come and get our mail whenever we want when uh, during normal business hours the rest of this is open this is where they collect our uh, our boxes or UPS's anything from Amazon um, the lady that runs this place will take care of our mail for us or grab our mail out of the box that you just saw over there gather it all up and ship it to us if we want to so that's how we do our mail well, if you can see through the window there, you can see a ferry coming in. And I know we're, it's cold outside, so we're kind of hiding in the truck. And we just did a time lapse of that, so I hope you enjoy the time lapse we're going to play for you. Uh, just driving around, having a little fun, doing a little photography, and trying to keep our ears warm. Stay tuned. guys this is Rob I want to apologize we don't have a really interesting video for the weekend if anybody knows anything about Washington State we got dumped on so we got some really rainy 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 weather which is pretty much pretty much uh, don't do anything other than go shopping 
so that's pretty much what we did most of the weekend so one of the things I told you about last week is our LED lights so we did go back up to camping world and get some more lights I still got a long ways to go but we did the entire bathroom area and the hallway and a couple of uh, side lights that we use commonly uh, ones that we would anticipate we'd want to use if we were off the grid and uh, another thing that we're doing is we have a new camera we want to show you and we're trying to get some sample um, shots done and so the weather hasn't been helping much in that either so I want to thank everybody for watching RV Travel Quest and me and Sherry uh, we are starting to get our finalization of some of our little extra things we wanted for the RV before we go traveling at all and uh, so we actually are modifying our uh, rails we use for our septic hoses we just uh, uh, fixed that got since we're going to be in warmer weather we got tire covers for the fifth wheel and so those are the kind of things we're doing right now uh, pulling in a few more pieces of equipment electronic that will help with uh, doing uh, uh, more reviews of uh, places that we're at and so that's all I got this week so I want to thank everybody who's been watching RV Travel Quest and me and Sherry uh, we hope you uh, like what we've been showing you uh, don't forget there's a contest going on for a free RV lock at RV Talk Radio and also RV Travel Buddy has been redesigned and so if you get a chance to go over to RV Travel Buddy uh, you'll see that we uh, now are starting to categorize all of our videos and all of our shows and uh, you can also submit your own articles now and uh, if you have videos that you want us to put on the site uh, just give us permission and we'll, uh, we'll put them on and that's all I got for now so once again from RV Travel Quest and me and Sherry thank you for watching please leave your comments please take the time to like our videos please subscribe and tell everybody about us we appreciate it Take care. Have a great evening. Bye.